Have you ever wondered what is the most dangerous thing about riding a roller coaster? Could it be that your restraint doesn't lock? Or two trains collide together? Or what about a tree falls down onto the track? And the answer is no. The most dangerous thing about riding a roller coaster is definitely not any of those. Because the honest answer is you. Welcome to Theme Park Predictions and more. My name is Brandon, and millions upon millions of people pull down their restraints once they board a roller coaster every single month. And every single one of those people expect to return to the station safely and enjoy their rest of the day in the park. While roller coasters are very large machines and some rare accidents do happen, in fact, 99% of accidents on roller coasters are because of something that you did while riding. When you head to your local theme or amusement park, you expect to have a safe ride on the roller coasters, right? You also don't want to lose any loose articles like your keys, wallets, or your cell phones while riding. Now serious question, have you ever been hit in the head by a falling brick before? And I sincerely hope not, but did you know that when you pull your cell phone out during a roller coaster or don't have it properly secured in your pocket, there is a very good chance that it could fall out during the ride. And once it does, it could fly back and hit another rider behind you or if the roller coaster goes over a midway, someone down below. While you don't, assume that your phone is that hard or heavy when it's flying at someone's face and they are traveling with the speed of the train, it would not only seriously hurt that person, but it could even kill them. So please, on behalf of every ride attendant out there and coaster enthusiast, please leave your phone in your locker, cargo pocket, or zipped up pocket, or better yet, with a non-rider. Because not only could you seriously hurt someone by losing your phone on a ride, you're going to never see that phone again, and buying a new phone definitely isn't cheap. If you are trying to film the roller coaster with your phone while you're on it, because you think that's really cool, well then just stop. Because the quality is going to be crap, and just check out the professional POVs by East Coasters, Attraction Source, Extreme Coasters, and Buckeye Coasters. All four of these channels offer the best of the best in coaster quality POVs, and all do it safely with GoPros that are physically attached to their bodies. Meaning that there is no way for that GoPro to slip out of their hands and hit someone behind them. Now, you need to go check out each of those channels and you can find the links for them in this video's description. I never really do this, but if you don't mind, since this topic is so critical in the future of roller coasters and riding safely, please share this video so more people can see it and get informed on just how dangerous riding roller coasters can be when you don't secure your phone. And if you share it on social media, feel free to tag Theme Park Predictions and more because I have a Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook account. I have been lucky enough to have thousands and thousands of laps on roller coasters in my lifetime. And I see people pull out their phones all the time, and some of them even lose them. Roller coasters are meant to be fun and most importantly safe. So please, let's keep it that way. Together, we can help someone from not getting their life altered because they wanted, just like you did, to ride a roller coaster and most importantly, have fun doing so. Have you ever seen anyone lose a loose article on a roller coaster before? Please share your story in the comments below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Remember to smile today, think positive, and keep riding coasters.